speaking of the president, fresh off his decision to back out of the Paris Climate Accord, by far the biggest environmental decision he's made since taking office, the White House also weighing whether or not to try and block fired FBI Director James Comey from testifying publicly next week. Big decisions, though there's one key question that's still up in the air. Yes or no, does the president believe that climate change is real and a threat to the United States? You, you know what's interesting about all the discussions we had through the last several weeks have been focused on one singular issue. Is Paris good or not for this country? What does the president actually believe about climate change? Does he still believe it's a hoax? Um, could you clarify that since apparently nobody else in the White House can? Yeah, you know, I have not had an opportunity to have that discussion. That's their line, and they're sticking to it, as though it doesn't matter what the president thinks. The president made a very courageous decision yesterday in behalf of America. He put America's interest first with respect to environmental agreements and inter international discussions. The White House ignoring scientists, CEOs, and even the Pope, all of whom condemned the Paris pullout. Business leaders Elon Musk and Bob Iger both resigning from the president's Economic Advisory Council. Last night, buildings, including One World Trade Center in New York and City Hall in Boston, were lit up in green in protest. Florida Governor Rick Scott, though, supportive of the president's move. I think what you saw of the president is he's doing exactly what he said he was going to do on the campaign. Uh, he's focused on American jobs. Meantime, new intrigue over next week's scheduled public testimony from fired FBI Director James Comey. Comey is expected to testify that the president tried to get him to back off his investigation of possible cooperation between the Trump campaign and Russia during the 2016 election. The president could claim executive privilege and keep Comey from speaking. Uh, that committee hearing uh, was just noticed, and I think obviously uh, it's got to be reviewed. So is that, that is not a no. no. It's just saying I don't, it, it literally, in my understanding is the date for that hearing was just set. I have not uh, spoken to counsel yet. I don't know what, what that, what they're going to, how they're going to respond.